come in this 7 December within the Achimansa enclave. When police tells me that they cannot, and when I come, I will not talk. I will beat you and the hell will you. I always want people to try me. So those of us seated here, any of you can try me on that day or try any of my men on that day. When you go to the polling station, just cast your vote. Go home, go and sleep. When it is 5 p.m., come. They will tell you where to stand. They will count for you. If you win, clap, go home. Then you will not have any problem with me and then my people. We are not going to sit down for just two or three people to distort the peace that Ghana is enjoying. That is why I don't vote. I don't want to belong to anybody, but I want to beat everybody. <laughs> we have a duty as religion or religious heads, as security heads, as family heads, as individuals to protect the good things that we have as a country. And the only good thing we have as a country now is the peace that we are enjoying. Because with the peace, everything can go on. If we distort it now, nothing can go on. See, you will be hungry more than me. And it is a fact. Because when there is war, I will still feed. I will get food from everywhere because I'll come and beat you and collect your food. <laughs> and I will feed. And it is a fact. I am hungry. You think if I see food with you and I have weapon, I will not kill you and take it. I will do. So it means that you will suffer more than me. And I don't want you to suffer, so I will beat the hell out of you. So please, if you want us to continue to live in peace, so that we can come around and then be talking to you, and then be happy with you, then these elections, let's maintain the peace that we are enjoying. On the seventh, we'll be selecting our new leaders for the next four years. Let me be very honest with you that nobody thinks about you. 